Step 1. Assure that the system is in standby and the cell is de-energized. Now, drain the cell. When the draining is complete, close the blue valve and tighten the fitting that was loosened to provide air. Position the three-way valve so that it goes to drain and not the oxygen tank. Prepare the brine pump acid recirculation. Preparing the discharge to go to drain. Preparing the acid to water mixture, please use caution. Please refer to the acid wash manual for the different mixtures for different types of acid. The system is now ready to begin the acid washing cycle. Enter diagnostics by pressing the diagnostic button on the display. On page two of the diagnostics, enter brine pump voltage of 3.0. This turns the brine pump on. Allow the pump to circulate the acid water mixture for about 25 to 30 minutes. Longer, upwards of 50 to 60 minutes if using a weaker acid solution or if cell is heavily calcified. Now that the acid wash is complete, return the brine pump voltage to zero. This turns the pump off. We will remove the acid bucket and install the soft, clean water bucket. This will be used to flush the cell.
Notice that the acid bucket and the fresh water bucket are only half full. The fresh water used to flush will then fill and dilute your acid waste bucket. Now that the flush is complete, return your brine pump voltage to zero. After discarding the acid wash mixture, refill the bucket with clean, soft water and repeat the process for rinsing the cell and the pump. After the second rinse cycle is, is complete, ensure the brine pump is turned off by, re, by returning the pump to zero volts. Return cell and pump plumbing to normal operating conditions. Step 7. Cell Water Purge. Initiate a flush by pushing the flush button on page 2 of the Diagnostics menu. Allow the system to purge the cell with water for 10 minutes to remove any residual acid that may remain in the cell. After the 10 minutes, end the flush by pushing the off button on page 2 of the diagnostics menu. Exit diagnostics. Run the flush into buckets and dispose of down the drain. This assures that no acid makes it into your oxidant lines or tanks. Position the three-way valve on the oxidant discharge line to the tank position. System restart. Restart the system in accordance with the operation and maintenance manual. Allow the system to operate and stabilize for 15 to 20 minutes. Check for leaks. The acid wash procedure is now complete.